Hi everyone, Heather Liu here of Closet Core Patterns coming to talk to you about our November pattern for Crew, which is our monthly uh, pattern subscription service. Um, every month we design a new pattern, we develop content around it, and the pattern this month is the Moonlight Dress, which I love kind of out of proportion. Like I love this pattern so much. Um, and it was actually Insider Baseball, the first pattern we drafted for Crew. Uh, we actually were thinking we were going to launch crew last year in October. Um, and that didn't end up happening. And then we pushed it, we pushed it. And the idea for this dress was always that it was like the kind of perfect holiday party dress. Like you have a party tonight and you need to make a dress. Like this is the pattern that you want to use. And so we ended up pushing it until November this year because it's kind of Christmas party season. You might be looking for, you know, that special dress that you're going to be wearing to those Christmas, New Year, Thanksgiving, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa parties. And we think this was a great pattern for that. Why? Well, as you can see, it's a kind of like a line shift dress. I think the size, I actually think I sized up for this one. So it's maybe a little bit bigger than it would be in reality with, you know, a generous amount of ease through the hips and the body. Um, it's got um, a beautiful kind of jewel neckline. And then in the back, this really pretty V neckline. When I'm always kind of obsessed with an unexpected um, peak of skin at the back, there's just something so pretty. I mean, this feels kind of modest and then you turn around and there's this little peak. I think it's really elegant. But what's special about Moonlight, besides the fact that it's got this kind of easy silhouette, which means you can eat as much turkey as you want. You're not going to have anything like digging into you, uh, which I think is always important <laughs> over the holidays that you're just like comfortable. Um, but it has kind of a minimal amount of design detail, which is wonderful if you are sewing with special fabrics like velvet or sequins or lace. When you're working with those types of fabrics, like for example, the sequin I'm working with now, you don't want a ton of seam lines. You don't want a lot of complicated um, construction seams because then at some point you have to deal and address with address the sequence at all of those junctures. So we wanted something that just had really simple design lines, had a beautiful silhouette, but really what this pattern is, is a beautiful canvas for your special fabrics. So if you've been hoarding velvet or lace or sequins or anything like that, or even just a really beautiful print, this pattern is going to let that fabric shine and it's going to do that with a minimal amount of effort on your end. Okay. This is a very simple, fast pattern to put together. And the other thing we wanted to do was give you the option to have it lined or unlined. So the one I'm wearing right now is um, lined. So there's like a, an actual lining. The lining comes right up here and it's, um, it, the sleeve is lined as well. So if you are sewing with one of those specialty fabrics, you want an intermediate level layer between your body and the fabric, you can uh, line it. But we also wanted to give you an option to do it unlined. So if you were doing it and say uh, a crisper fabric like this cotton twill, you don't, and you don't want a lining, you could just have a facing and then you don't even need to deal with the lining. And then if you're just doing the face version of this, this is like a three or four hours. So it's very, very fast. So that's the kind of thing that was the approach we're thinking. We wanted to give you something that's going to work with lots of different fabrics in lots of different applications. Could go fat casual, could go fancy. Um, and I think we've accomplished that. So other details about this pattern. So it ends just above the knee, um, but you of course can uh, shorten it to any length. So this really sweet kind of more casual version that we made for Justine, our um, uh, project manager, she did it in a cotton twill and she did it quite short. So it's like very 60s kind of mini. And we also have a view with a longer sleeve. So this is the shorter almost, it's not quite a cap sleeve, but it's a shorter sleeve. And then we also wanted to give you something a little bit longer. Um, either you just want to cover your arms or if it's cold, you want a little bit more length, you have that. And then because we're crazy and we can never just give you a thing, we also were like, wouldn't it be fun to give some collar options? So there's also these optional bonus collar pieces that are very kind of vintage 60s inspired. This idea actually came from Justine, who's like the 60s sewer in our office. And we have two options. So there's this one um, collar option here with this pointed collar, and then it's pointed in the back and it's kind of got this kind of sweet schoolgirl vibe I'm into. And then we also have an option where it's rounded. So the back is rounded and the front is rounded. So it's kind of like a big oversized Peter Pan collar, which are very happening right now in fashion. So if you wanted to add that kind of collar detail to Moonlight, you absolutely could. Um, if you want to leave it off and just have a simple sheath dress like this with, again, that like amazing moment in the back, you can do that as well. So the other beautiful thing about Moonlight is it works with a million different fabrics. Like I already said, those kind of specialty fabrics, your velvet, your sequins, we've got some really pretty 
um, options in stock at Core Fabrics, including this gorgeous sequin, which is like one of my most favorite fabrics ever. Um, and it's actually a really small sequin, so it's quite easy to sew with. You don't even have to remove them from the seam lines. If you've, if you've ever sewn with sequins before, you know that it's a nightmare to have to like manually remove all of them. But these ones, the sequin's tiny, you don't need to. Um, it also works for like even drapey fabrics like viscose, rayon, um, the beautiful kind of 60s print here. This is a satin viscose and it's quite drapey. We lined it, but it worked really well. It gave us really pretty kind of soft, swingy effect. So if you have a really pretty viscose print or a silk print, this is going to work great. And it also works for more structured fabrics like this cotton twill. So you really, the sky's the limit in terms of woven fabrics that you would like to use for this, this pattern. And because it's such a great building block pattern, it's just really up to you to decide how do you want to customize it? I mean, I'm picturing a really beautiful lace version with maybe a contrast lining underneath. So you could have like a white lace and like a pink lining or something. There's just, it's such a great pattern for you to explore your creativity and and then in the end have this really beautiful dress that was like not hard to make and is really comfortable and hopefully you're going to get tons of wear out of for all of the parties in your life so that's moonlight if you like any of these versions we have the full fabric kits over on core fabrics along with other um, appropriate fabrics that we'll be linking to in the collection for moonlight once again it's available when you sign up for crew our monthly uh, pattern service which starts at uh, ten dollars a month um, and we also have an incredible deal with our unlimited membership, which means you get all of the patterns we've done in the past year, plus the next 12 patterns. Um, and yeah, we're really excited about this one. We can't wait to see what you make with Crew Moonlight.